हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम हार्दिक पटेल वेलकम बैक टू पाइथन ट्यूटोरियल सो इन प्रीवियस लेसन वी लर्न हाउ टू इंस्टॉल पाइथन एंड वी आल्सो सी दैट द एनवायरनमेंट वेरिएबल वाज सेट प्रॉपर्ली एंड दैट इज व्हाई वी कैन एक्सेस दिस पाइथन डायरेक्टली इन द कमांड प्रॉम्प्ट ओके सो वी आर गोइंग टू यूज द पाइथन लाइब्रेरी टू एग्जीक्यूट वन प्रोग्राम एंड फॉर दैट टुडे वी विल जस्ट सी दैट हाउ we can uh, create one program of python basic program and uh, we also we will see that few like indentation how it works that is what and uh, let's see how it, how can we execute that so for that just you open terminal uh, in a linux system and if you are in a windows system then just open command prompt and open any editor uh, to write a program just navigate to your directory and just create one program like this code basic dot py i have just already created but that is blank so i am just opening that code basic dot py and it will be open here and just for the uh, for the sake uh, we are just uh, one program with just hello world hello world okay let's save it and then execute it python basic dot py so you can see that hello world is printed here because and one more thing is that uh, python is basically interpreter language so it uh, first interprets this and uh, also it uh, it is not completely uh, interpreted because it is creating cache file like pyc.pyc okay so what what it does just uh, one time it executes uh, row by row and then automatically it cached so in next time Uh, yeah, Python do not need to see that any uh, syntax error or few things don't need to be done, right? So because of that PYC file, the execution will be faster in next time. So and after that, if you change something in the Python program, it will automatically detect that. So and uh, it will generate the PYC file again for next time. Okay. So let's focus in this program for now. Uh, we have printed hello world. And now I'm just commenting this, so you can see that how we can comment the line in Python program. Just write this hash, or there is another way is to execute command like this way. Okay. Also, you can use double quote three times. Right. Okay. So currently this is only one line, so I'm just using hash. Okay. Now I'm creating few variables like sorry first name is Hardik last is equal to tail. Then one flag I am uh, declaring that is uh, name equal to. Now I am just writing one if condition here. If name then print first and print last. Okay. Else. no name is available okay so name variable uh, assign that if a uh, name is available or not that's it so right now name is true so it will go to in if condition and it will print first and last and if this was false then python will execute this line okay let's execute this file basic.py you can see hardik space hardik and patel okay now let me change to false and what it does next so no name is available okay so now in this program what you what you see that that is indentation so there is no uh, curly braces we are using in this program because python doesn't support the curly braces instead of that just they uh, they separate all this all this uh, code uh, by just indentation like if you have this for space indentation then you should have all the all uh, all lines should have four spaces inside this f if condition right so this all line of code must have four spaces for indentation but let me show you that what if we have added one more space here by mistake and run the program so it says that indentation error on expected indentation right so let me correct this and execute again 
now it is working fine okay now in else if i make five spaces then what it will does let's see see because this is not giving error because inside this else we have only one line and that automatically understandable right so what it will does what it will do is that five spaces standard it will make five spaces standard for else loop in this program so whenever i write any next line it must be in a this is new line and if I, if i run this program there will not be any problem but again if i make four spaces for next line then it will create error indentation error on indent doesn't match any other indentation level that means for this level this is one level you can say and inside that if i write again name that thing inside else okay not it will give again again error but if i do this now it will work fine and if i add one more space here also it will work fine why because inside else we have used four spaces for indentation for all lines like until this if because these are on the same level but inside f there is another level this is child level right so in that we have defined five spaces so for all the lines inside this if must have five spaces indentation so that is how indentation works in this python programming so that's it how you can uh, execute basic python program so see you in our next lesson uh, we will see more lectures here so for now thank you for watching